Hi, this is Andy Mattingly and I'm here with this week's Save It Up Moment. Our topic this week is tips to save for retirement like the rich. Now you may not be able to do all of these tips because of course we're not all rich, but if we can kind of take some of these principles and apply it to our life, we are going to be better off. So let's start with the first tip. And the first tip is save more than the average for retirement. Goal is to be a 10% to save for your retirement, which means you can almost live the same lifestyle in retirement as you are in your working life. The rich, they get above 15%. So if we want to save like the rich, we want to give ab above 15% because we're likely going to be able to have the same or even better lifestyle um, when we're older or retired than we are today if we can get above that. The second tip is live with frugality in mind. And I know that means different things to different people, but the biggest thing or way that you can do this is don't up your expenses every time you get a raise. So if you get a raise, only let your expenses go up no more than 50% of what your raise is. And that means, you know, don't buy the newer car, don't buy the bigger house, those types of things. So if you can do that, eventually you're gonna have more money to do the first one, which is save more than the average. The next thing is, if you have retirement savings, make sure you diversify your portfolio. A diversification of your portfolio allows you to have better protection against wild swings in the market. The second thing is have other sources of income. A lot of people that are rich don't just derive all of their income from their current job. They have other investments such as rental property or they have part-time jobs, speaking gigs, things like that that they do that earn extra income and they just save all of that. So that's another tip that you can use that the rich do. The other thing is start early and make it automatic. And what that means is if you have access to a 401k plan, you have access to automated withdrawals for mutual funds, things like that, start as early as you can. You know, in your 20s is the best, but if you're not in your 20s, start now and make it automatic. Make it come out every month before you even see your money. And that's a good way to do it. And the other tip there is you can also make it automatically increase every year so you're saving more. And the last one is don't carry a lot of debt. Pay off your cars and your houses in a timely manner. Don't carry a lot of credit card debt. And look that when you get to retirement that you've gotten rid of most of your debt. Borrow during your younger years and make sure as you're getting older, you're getting your debt paid off. That's this week's Save It Up moment. If you need more information about any of the topics that we've ever discussed on Save It Up, make sure you visit forumcu.com and the Save It Up page.